everyone, my name is Jocelyn from Empire Coast, Jakarta. I'm from Bunda Hati Kudus Junior High School. As someone who really loves Roblox, I really want to play a Roblox game that has a different color than what I've played before. So, I made my own game with my own version. This game is so cool. It's a perfect fit for you who loves challenges and adventures. Because this game is about kings and dragons. You will face exhilarating challenges. Along the journey, there will be scary dragons who are ready to destroy you at any time with its fireballs. Finally, if you already complete all the challenges, you will meet a charismatic king that's waiting for your victory at the end of the game. In this game, there are some secret portals that will give you a surprise ending. I made two choices of paths with two different endings to give more surprises for you who play this game. Let's play this game now! Yes, this is the starting point where the big adventure begins. First of all, we need to open the white door. Simply press the yellow button. You can see the simple script for the button. When the player clicks the button, the script will run and the door will be transparent. Now you can go through. After that, you will find a warm-up obby so you can prepare for your next journey. There's a checker obby for this part of the game. And I used a kill script. It will run when you jump on the white part and you will die. After you pass the checker obby, there's a bridge of doom obby. This is a tricky bridge full of traps. All the bridges are fake except for one bridge. You have to be very lucky to beat this bridge of doom. The next part, you are forced to choose your destiny. One of the paths is a dragon land and the other is a king's destiny. Your destiny depends on what you choose here. Either you become a king or become the ruler of the dragons. After you choose your destiny, you must go through the portal that you choose and it will teleport you to the other location. I am using a teleportation script here. In this section, the first challenge is you must get through some green balls. This part is tricky because the balls are quite high and you might slip off. The next challenge is you will have to cross some walls. And then you must follow the path. And down to the last challenge, jump through some kill parts. And that's the end. Now you can play around with the speed pad and slow pad. The script I use for the speed pad is a speed script. If you touch the part, you will be super fast. Slow pad is the opposite. I use slow script. So if you touch the part, you will be super slow. And you must not forget to speak with the knight so it can take you to the castle. Good luck! The other path that you can choose is the dragon land. If you choose this path, congratulations, you are a true warrior. The dragon land is a lot more difficult. First, you must jump on some flying blocks. After you pass that, you must beat the square of doom. On top of that, there are some deadly cylinders that you must go around. And the last challenge is to get past some lava towers. And then you reach the end. You will be the ruler of the dragons. Now it's time for the bad secret ending. At the start of the game, there is a red portal with the sign, Shortcut to the end. If you go inside, it's actually just an empty room with a sign, Haha, just kidding, you know you're trapped. And you'll be stuck there the entire time. And there is definitely a good secret ending. The good secret ending lets you see outside the castle and see the POV of being a red or green dragon. And in order to get the secret ending, you must find the hidden port. Now, from the design perspective, I actually built all the things from scratch. I got inspired from a model in the toolbox. But because we can't use that, I decided to make my own. It started with just making a square for the walls. Then I made a tower and just duplicated. After making the towers, I made the stairs step by step. Then it's all finished! I just added a camping area with the prince and princess next to it. And I added a little red flag. And after about one month during the design, voila! The palace is finished! As you can see, this is a beautiful palace. Way cooler than the Buckingham Palace, right? I hope all of you who play my game will be happy. Thank you!